and import random. Um, so this is what the what it drops. No. So you want to go ahead and do main class or whatever you do your main class, and then choose the or for now. Uh, actually, we're gonna have to. Um, if you want to make the block drop itself, you can just do this. The block ID. It's pretty simple. Uh, you want to add in the public int. Uh, what's it called? The uh, quantity drop, I think. <coughs> quantity drop, and that is a random. Uh, and this is just uh, a number, so it's an integer, so you should just like that. And at last, you can go into your item, copy this register icons thing, or just type it out yourself. And uh, change this to block. And do modium. And do modium or. Because we're going to put in our modium or texture. Which is called modium or and capitalized. No, no, not capitalized. Some of the words are capitalized. But not all of them. Just like that. And uh, yeah, that's basically how you make a block. This is very simple coding. Um, but this is also for beginners. So uh, you want to go ahead and import it, and uh, when bam, there you go. You're done. I'm not going to show you how you. All right, let's just do that. No, yeah, no, yeah. I don't even know if we should. Let's just do it anyway. So you, for those of you that. I wouldn't really care about making another block, just skip this part and go on to the next video. But, um, yeah, you can just copy all the code or write it out yourself again. I am not gonna write it out again. But, um, yeah. There we go. And again, this will make it drop itself, which we want. But we actually don't want this in the R. But in the next episode, we'll go ahead and make um, the item. And basically, only th the only thing I'm going to show you is how you put up the file because we already made our item um, right here and um, right there. So you kind of know how to make an item. It's not really that hard. And um, yeah, there we go. Let's. Um, Oh yeah, and let's drag in that texture as well. So a modium block into the blocks. And let's go ahead and run this. So again, it's gonna lag because of the recorder, but we're I'm just gonna show you that it will. Oh yeah, before we do this, actually, let me just go ahead and um, when it's open, close this down again. Come on, come on. Because we need to add it to our um, creative tab. So uh, I'm just pause it until it's done. Alright, uh, you want to add in. You can add it in here or in your main class. We're just going to add it here. So we'll do uh, this set creative tab. Where's your tab? And you want to do main class dot modium or whatever you named yours. Yeah, this is how you add it to your own creative tab. Like that. And let's go ahead and play. Alright, like that. Let's go and all. And uh, let's go in the creative tab. And uh, it's not there. Give me a second. Alright, I just stopped. <laughs> um, how could I be so dumb? 
we need of course to register the block and add in the name for it. I am very, very stupid, but uh, bear with me. So let's do the um, registering and names. So first of all you want to register <coughs> you want to register your block. So uh, game I think it's game registry for forge. Oh I just spelled that wrong. Game registry dot um dot register block modium or and then I'm gonna add this comma and you just want to put in modium or so. so you need to do this with all your blocks not with your items but with your um, blocks and also to add the name you do language register dot add name we do modium or and this is the in-game name, so not in all. Language registry. Dot. Ready? What? Language registry. Um. All right. Modium. Rock. And the modium block as well. Alright, I'm just gonna run it again. There we go. We got our modium over and modium block in here and the item group modium. Um, I'm gonna fix that in the next episode. I'm gonna tell you what you have to do to make this called um, modium. But yeah, there we go. We have our blocks and wow, it's really like we can place them and they look good. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode and I'll see you guys in the next episode where we will. Um, at, uh, items so uh, yeah um, yeah thanks for watching and as always have a great day or night and I'm out under your super constructor and also copy in this method called um, public boolean has effect uh, let's just add by the way you items. didn't already use boolean these um, two different values took true or false yeah